Hello everyone, welcome to Aurelia's Crafting Ideas. I have a new Dollar Tree haul to share with you and let me show you all the cute goodies I picked up. Let's start with these eggs. Aren't these gorgeous? They're sequin eggs and you get six eggs and you get um, six different colors. Look at this. Isn't that gorgeous? I picked up uh, four packages. So yeah, this is what it looks like. Look how how big and cute it is. I love it. So we have the light blue one. We have a yellow, a pink, a purple, a green, and an orange. I love them. They're so cute. I need to figure something out with it. So stay tuned for that one. They're so gorgeous. Now look at these. I've seen everyone haul these, and I'm like, ooh, I want some, and I finally found it. We have 16 mini foam mushrooms in each package. I found it in these three colors, so I, uh, I'm on the watch out to see if there's other colors. So I found the pink, the purple, and the aqua colors. Are they gorgeous? Okay, look, you get two clumps of it and two different sizes in one package. I like that one. So you get this one. Look how tiny that is. So cute. And look at this one. Oh, there's a lot of things you can do with that. If you don't want it on the the stem, just pull it off the stem and, and you work that into your arrangement, right? Look at this. So cute. This will look excellent like in a... a a fairy garden right adorable and then here's the purple ones so cute and then the the aqua ones or teal whichever one aquamarine turquoise <laughs> look at this it's so cute i love them so adorable i only picked up one package each I did not need, need that much. First of all, I wasn't quite positive what I would do with it. You know, I was thinking, well, I can throw some in the fairy garden. Then I'm like, hmm, what else can I do with the rest? So if you want to have ideas, let me know. Besides using it in a landscape, how else do you use a mushroom? One's just tiny anyways, right? So I have those. Oh, and look. I picked up four boxes of these lights. These are indoor use only lights and you get 10 lights per string. They're LED lights and I picked up the carrots. There's uh, four different designs that Dollar Tree is carrying so hopefully you've seen all four designs. But look at this. Such cute little carrots. Isn't that adorable? Oh, and look, wait, hold on. I bought some batteries. <laughs> I bought a package of the triple A and the double A. I'm like, I need some batteries. So I'm going to um, put some lights in here and let's take a look. There we go. Oops. Okay, and drop these in here. And then it's very bright. Maybe if I cup it, can you see it better? I don't know. But look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Hopefully you can see it better on screen. I'm looking at this and because it's so bright, I want to change the lights out. I want to use warm lights. I think it'll work better with warm lights than it does with the LED lights. Because we love LED lights, but it's so bright. It kind of makes it yellowish. And I prefer to keep the orange uh, carrots. But cause see, look, how cute is that, right? I'm going to switch out the, um, the lights. Because I do have some um, warm lights somewhere. <laughs> so I'll just, you know, I'll just pop these off because 
it is held in there with um, just a little plug. Gorgeous. I will probably use a timer light. That way, you know, I don't have to sit there and turn on every time I want to look at them. But how gorgeous. So I got those. I have four of them. So cute. They have um, eggs also in multiple colors. I was tempted to get the eggs and then I'm like, no, I want the I want the carrot ones. So I got the carrots. So there's that one. And then um, I found the fabrics too. Look. Perfect colors to make carrots. And then these are just solid um, fabrics. And they're 18 by 21 inches. I found two, so I picked up both of them. And then I also found this one. This is a striped one. But this one is a repurchase. I purchased this before. I think it was um, the last um, harvest season when they first came out in this uh, warm tone, you know, fall colors. So I remember seeing this one and I know I picked it up. Or maybe it's similar. Who knows? I'll have to go look through my fabric collection and see. But it just seems very familiar. So I found the one, so I picked it up. And then, let's see what else I picked up. Oh, this is a repurchase. I needed some more rubber bands. So I picked up this one. This is um, a Vantage uh, brand. And it's made in the USA, I believe. Yep, it is made in the USA. And you get... Well, let's see. It usually has a weight. I don't see one, but... Yeah, I don't see a uh, weight on here. But, um, we, you get multiple sizes, and this is what I like. So I went ahead and picked this up. I think these rubber bands, they work better. They don't break as easily as the Dollar Tree brand. So this is a good buy for a dollar twenty-five. If you see it, uh, grab one. I also decided to pick up this uh, wall decal, or their Main Street wall creations, and they're the mason jars. Is you got one gallon, uh, quarts, pints, cups, ounce, three. 8 liters well how much the measurements is you know the gallons that breaks it up but how cute right I love the different sizes of the mason jars and I want to use those as a template is why I picked it up so I love the, the lid details you know isn't that gorgeous it's not just like one little solid piece they actually put some thought into this. I like it. So I picked up one. And then look at these stickers I decided to pick up. I think these work really well for like uh, Valentine and for spring season. This I picked up. This is, uh, it says Magic On. You get 10 uh, stickers. But they're the pansies. I think it's a pansy, but how gorgeous is that? Look at this. And then you get the, like the raised edges so you can actually tell which leaf is on top of which. Isn't that gorgeous? See, it's like embossed, right? The petals. I like it. Let's see, I picked up four of them and they're all the same. Well, they have it in other um, floral too, but this is the one I wanted. So gorgeous. So I got that one. And then I saw these at one of my stores and I'm like, ooh, I like these. I had bought some keys and locks before in the same uh, puffy stickers, but I believe it's a different pattern. So this one is a little bit new. I like the antique look on here. So gorgeous. So you get 13 stickers on this one. Oh, gorgeous. Now I wish the keys didn't match the locks. 
The only one I'm thinking is maybe this one will fit in there. Let me see. But I can still work with it. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It'll fit in there. See there? So you can pair these two right here. And then the rest will just have to um, pair them somehow individually. But gorgeous. And I decided to pick up three of them because I want to um, use them as individual looking locks, you know, like a full lock. Not, I can't do that to all of it, but I can take them and, you know, like put them back to back like this one. I can take another one and put it on the back side. So that'll make it like one complete lock. Isn't that gorgeous? I don't think I'll be able to do it with the keys, but I will, I'll figure something out, but how gorgeous. Yeah, I picked up three of those. The last items I picked up are these uh, list pads. They're just cute little note pads and you get um, one pad that says, today is your day. So I picked up two. I was thinking at the time that they were actually separated, like the one for the goals, the one for the gratitude. Um, but it's all one sheet. Look at that. But you can you can separate it. There's a perforated line here. You can t definitely tear this off here like this, and then you can separate the gold and the gratitude. Oh well, I have. <laughs> I separated two, but look, they're very thin. So this is great, right? This will be wonderful to use in the journals. Nice, I like it. And then of course we got the the actual writing pad here and it's dotted. So, and if you don't want it to say today is your day, you can definitely cut the, the paper down right here. Take this strip off. Same thing if you don't want the butterflies on the bottom, just trim it on the bottom line there. Cute. Let's see. You get oh, 60 sheets. And they are 5.625 by 7.25 inches. I like it. They're very thin though, just so you're aware. You know. If you want to, um, you know, use it like a note card or whatever, I would put like some kind of card stock on the back. It'll make it a little bit more sturdier. But how cute is that? Now, uh, this is the only one I've seen at my store. I don't know if it comes in another version, but how gorgeous. I like that one. So pick those up. Well, this is everything I picked up on my trip to Dollar Tree this week. I found some cute little stuff. Quite happy with it. And I love my new carrot lights. I can't wait to use them. They're so cute. Well, once I change out the light, that is. <laughs> oh, it's the empty box. And I love these little eggs. They're so cute. It makes me want to make my own, but the only thing with that is I have to buy the sequins first, and I don't know where I would find like um, all the sequin colors that I want. I think Dollar Tree might have some, but I've yet to see it in the Easter section. I've seen ribbons there, but not the sequin ones yet. Hmm, I have to go on a hunt to see if I can find some. And I'll get this. These mushrooms are so cute. Adorableness. Wait, I'm missing this one? Oh, here it is. Oh, look at that. Oh, love those. And then, of course, I will be making some carrots soon. And I hope you join me for that. Thank you for stopping by. This is Aurelia at Aurelia's Crafting Ideas, and I will see you next time.